I'm Matt Stroll with RV1 Superstores. I'm here to go over the all new Jayco Precept. Right behind me is the all new Jayco Precept 31UL model. Starting off at the front, you'll notice a massive, massive windshield. This windshield is a 120 inch windshield. Most brands in this price point are gonna give you a 96, maybe a 100 inch windshield. Not the Jayco Precept, this is a 120 inch windshield. It's the largest of its kind. This is the same exact windshield Integra uses on their Cornerstone, which is $700,000 diesel pusher. You get the same windshield on your Jayco Precept, which is a third of the cost. That's amazing. The unique thing here is they actually wrap it around the side corner. Most brands don't have that ability to wrap their windshield because it's not made out of Turkish sand. This glass is actually molded with imported Turkish sand. No other brand uses that. It's a little bit more costly, but it, it's well worth the safety for your family and the better visibility here. It's also set in a one piece molded fiberglass front cap. Most brands just put a cheap fiberglass front on it. Not the Jayco Precept this is a molded one piece fiberglass front cap. You're not gonna get any leaks. It's a more automotive style and it just gives it a real high, high end look. Down below here, they actually etched in chrome is a accent LED light above the three headlights. Down below, they actually come standard with fog lights. Most brands don't put fog lights on their Class A's, not the Jayco Precept, comes with fog lights recessed in the one piece fiberglass front cap. Right up top here, you're gonna notice massive windshield wipers. A lot of brands put the windshield wipers usually about half this, not the Jayco Precept. So in inclement weather, you're gonna be able to see where you're going. You'll also notice that they actually put a partial body paint on the front cap this year, which is amazing. It really sets it off, the two-tone color. They did a phenomenal, phenomenal job here. Swinging on over to the passenger side of the coach, you're gonna notice upgraded heavy-duty chrome mirrors. This is amazing. It really gives it that resilient look, very high-end bus look, and they also put recessed side cameras with infrared capability so you can see day or night. That's amazing, that's Jayco. This unit is actually powered by a Ford V10 engine, and this is on the 22,000 pound chassis. That's gonna give you the cargo carrying capability that you're looking for. Down below, this is actually sitting on 22 and a half inch Michelin tires. They're not some Chinese cheap tire. A lot of brands put those Toyos or whatever they call them. This is actually a Michelin RV marine grade tire. And then you're actually also gonna get Alcoa Durabrite tires or rims, I should say. So the Dur Durabrite Alcoa rims with just soap and water, they shine up, look beautiful for years to come. And then the nice thing here, this is all aluminum, so it's not gonna just pop off when you go down the road. A lot of the other brands put cheap wheel liner inserts. You go over a bump, they pop right off, and it just destroys the look of the coach and the resale value. That's why any Jayco motorhome in the market, you're gonna get six to 8% better resale value. Swinging on over to the side here, you're gonna notice the paint infused fiberglass. They did like a champagne paint infused fiberglass this year. It looks phenomenal. It actually has a clear gel coat over it so you don't get the spider webbing. And on top of that, with the clear Lamalux gel coat that they use, you don't get the fibers that you'll get in the traditional fiberglass that you use with some of those other cheaper brands. Up top, you're gonna notice the frameless windows. It's actually a jalousy window, so it's, it's actually more utility to it than any other window out there. So you can actually crank it out about 30 degrees. When it rains outside, you got that extra airflow versus those other 50-50 windows where it's either open or closed and there's no two ways about it. This gives it a high-end bus look. And then of course, you don't have to worry about that rubber seal that you'll get on some of those other cheaper trailer style windows that they use on those other lower end motor homes that are gonna leak over time. On top of the slide out here, you're gonna notice an uh, upgraded slide topper. This is amazing. Jayco actually puts Carefree Colorado slide toppers on their slide outs. This comes standard with this unit at that super low sale price. That's amazing. 
It also has a protective cover on it. So when you're going down the road, if you do happen to hit, snag a tree branch, it's not gonna tear your slide topper. That'll save you hundreds of dollars in the long run. Remember, it's all about resale value and keeping it looking fresh for years to come. At the entry door, this is amazing. The entry door is a wider entry door, has a massive window on it to bring a lot of air inside. And then also it's frameless as well. So it gives it that nice high end look and you can see who's right at your front door anytime, day or night. Down below, it also has a two tier electric step. The nice thing here, it gives it a nice easy transition. It's only about two, three inches off the ground. Most brands will only give you a one tier step, not the Jayco Precept. You get a two tier entry step and it's power and it's automatic with the door. Jayco is not scared to give your family a two year exclusive warranty on your Jayco Precept. You get two full camping seasons of coverage. That's awesome. Coming on up, you're gonna notice the J-Ride Plus emblem. Another phenomenal attribute to Jayco's quality and their 50 year heritage. It's amazing. This is an exclusive feature. The J-Ride Handling Plus package is unlike any other handling package out in the market today. It actually comes with four upgraded components. You're actually gonna get jounce bumpers on the front and the back of the motor coach. That's gonna stop the wandering and the porpoising that you'll get on some of those other cheaper units that don't come with jounce bumpers. Below that, you're also gonna get, get front and rear stabilizer bars. You're not gonna get that shimmy or shake going down the road. You don't have to feel, oh geez, I hope the wind's down today. You're not gonna have to worry about the weather. You're also gonna get a computerized balanced drive shaft. Most brands don't balance the drive shaft and that's gonna give a lot of shudder and shake. It's gonna be a nice steady ride with the Jayco J-Ride handling package. You also pick up on the J-Ride Plus package, which is on the Precept, is a heavy duty stabilizer bar on the front. You're gonna be able to just literally one hand it. I drove this here today and I literally had two fingers on the steering wheel. You get that with the J-Ride handling package. Coming on down, you're gonna notice another storage compartment. All the compartments on this unit are side hinged. This particular one has the propane tank in it. And you also have an enhanced Moride slide tray. It's encased in metal. It's not plastic. You can pull it out to do maintenance. A lot of brands you have to kind of crawl underneath the unit to change out batteries or what have you. Here you actually get two batteries versus one. No charge at that super low sale price. I almost forgot all the storage up here. There's so much storage and so many compartments. I didn't want to miss any. You actually have two massive storage compartments. It actually has Rotocast storage compartments. This is a one piece material. You can spray it out with a hose, wipe it down with a towel. Super easy to maintain. Again, you're going to get that six to 8% better resale value on your Jayco versus any other motorhome out there. On top of that two year warranty we talked about. You also have LED lights. So you can see what you're doing at nighttime and it won't drain your battery as much as the cheaper halogen lights that some of those other brands still give you. Coming on over this massive awning. So it actually comes standard with a huge carefree Colorado black framed power awning. That's awesome. Has an integrated LED light for nighttime. And then down below has a huge, huge 40 inch HD flat panel TV. You can actually pull it out on the arm. You can adjust the visibility. You can you know, watch it at almost any angle. The other cool thing about this entertainment compartment is that, I don't know if you can hear that, but it's actually encased in metal. I don't know of any other entertainment area in the industry that's actually encased in metal. You can hear the quality too. I mean, it's just like a, a bank vault. That's awesome. It has a, your own little lock there. Coming on over, you also have your hot water heater. So it's gas and electric, and it's DSI, direct spark ignition. You can simply just press a button and turn it on inside before your shower. Coming on to the back of the coach. Remember, we have a front one-piece fiberglass molded front cap, but we also have this massive one-piece rear cap. Nice thing here, you're not gonna get any water intrusion you can't get any delamination the way this thing is built. It's amazing. You also have a third brake light. Come standard with the Jayco Precept. 
Most brands skip that, no third brake light on most of the other brands. What that's gonna give you is increased safety. If you're towing a boat or a car, people are gonna be able to see you day or night. Above that, huge massive frameless window. Again, that cranks out, you get better airflow. On top of that, you have your backup camera and it's, it's day or night, so it's infrared. I mean, it's straight military, that's amazing. On top of that, this roof is made of a pebble green fiberglass roof with UV inhibitor in it. That's amazing. A lot of brands, 31 foot, 35 foot, doesn't really matter. Most of them use that cheap rubber roof. It gets chalky, really moldy and dirty on the sidewall. Not on the Jayco Precept. You're actually gonna get a pebble grain fiberglass roof with UV inhibitor mixed in it. So it's gonna last a super, super long time. You don't have to worry about getting brittle over the years because they do put that UV inhibitor inside of that pebble green fiberglass roof, with it, which is very, very substantial. Coming on down at the bottom here, you're gonna notice it actually comes standard at that super low sale price with a 5,000 pound hitch. To the left, it also has a seven way round and a four way flat as well. Down below, another storage compartment for your 50 amp power cord. So this is a 25 foot power cord. This unit is equipped with 50 amps of power nice thing there folks is you're actually going to get two rooftop mount acs on a 31 foot motorhome that's pretty rare most brands will only give you one one ac unit this actually has two a 15,000 b2 ac in the front and a 13.5 in the back bedroom this storage compartment this is pretty much your camper's corner this is all your hookups here so you have your black sewer tank flush that's going to clean out your holding tank very easily just hook on a uh, water hose you have your outdoor shower with your hose right here city water connections if you're dry camping if you want to winterize it on the bottom you also have a water purification system so a full coach water pur purification system built in standard a lot of brands that's a 300 dollars option not with the jaco precept standard Swinging on over, you're gonna notice you have an area for your black and gray water holding tanks. For the sake of time, you know how that works. Over here, you're gonna notice this has a Onan 5500 watt Cummins D, uh, gas generator. It's built actually on a steel tray here. The nice thing there, it's not gonna shake and rattle like some of those other brands. Super, super quiet. And again, all your storage compartments have a side hinge here a piano style hinge, which is just gonna make life a little bit easier when you're getting items in and out of your storage compartment. A lot of brands put the top hinge and then you have to do this like weird kind of, I don't know, Olympic little stretch just to get into your storage compartment. Here, it, it actually is a side hinge, so the door itself is completely out of the way. So you got a huge pass through there, then another one here from the other side that we saw earlier today. And then you have another decent sized storage compartment. You can put tools and what have you in that one. As we come in the all new Jayco Precept, there's so many awesome features. In this 31 UL floor plan, this is gonna give you three slide rooms. Right when you first walk in, you're gonna see this phenomenal gourmet kitchen. This is absolutely amazing, folks. This, the countertops actually made a solid surface stonework. So you don't have any cheap laminate here that can bubble up over time. So that's solid. And then you have a nice pull out additional counter space here for prep work. Look at the bank of storage drawers here. You have one, two, three, four, and they're on a full frame metal ball bearing drawer glide with 75 pounds of cargo carrying capacity. Up top in the kitchen, like I said, this is truly gourmet. You have a uh, beautiful high point, high efficiency, uh, stainless steel, microwave, and convection, so you can get pizzas in here, Thanksgiving turkey, whatever you want, oversized microwave and convection oven. Tons more storage over here. Again, you have mortise and tenon, tongue groove cabinet doors with metal hinges instead of plastic, and then you have a hidden hinges as well, so you don't have the hinges showing. A very European style, high-end look. And again, look at all the counter space here. You have massive amounts of counter space. 
My wife would love cooking in here. You have solid surface covers over the stainless steel undermount sink. So this is, you know, super easy for cleanup. You can just wipe things right into the stainless steel sink. It's not plastic like some of those other cheaper brands. Remember, this is a Jayco. And then you have a huge gooseneck faucet. This is a metal faucet with a pull-out sprayer for those bigger pots and pans, easy cleanup. And then you also have a massive pantry here with adjustable shelves. They did a phenomenal job. I love the woodwork in here. And then over to your left, this is really cool how this 31UL floor plan works out. When you walk in, your refrigerator is right to your left. This is actually a residential refrigerator, stainless steel. I mean, this refrigerator is 10 times bigger than one at my own house. It actually has a metal lock right here for safety travel. A lot of brands just put a cheap plastic lock. You turn around a corner, everything's on the ground. This is a 21 cubic foot residential refrigerator. Look how massive this is. Goes all the way up to the ceiling. Has an ice maker. You can put crushed ice, cubes, whatever you want. Water purification system, LED lights. You have just a bank of drawers on both sides. Massive amounts of storage. A residential 21 cubic foot refrigerator. Comes standard on the 31 UL this year at that special sale price. That's amazing. You can also get a glass of water and fill up your ice right here. Super, super handy right in the entry door here. If we swing over to the couch, the couch, all the furniture in here is made by Flex Steel. So Flex Steel has been around for ages and Flex Steel actually carries a lifetime warranty on the framework itself. This is actually a tri-fold couch. It actually is really, really easy to set up. So this just pulls out. It literally just takes a quick minute. I want to just stop for one second and just point out that in every seating position in a Jayco motorhome, they actually put actually braced seat belts. So this is amazing. So you have additional metal bracing in every Jayco motorhome. So everywhere you can sit, you can actually bring probably the whole clan with you. You can bring two, four, six, seven, you can bring eight people safely with you on any camping trip you go on, not have to leave anyone behind because you don't have enough seat belts. So this is actually rated for 1,100 pounds. So it's, it's really not about cutting corners at Jayco. I know other brands, it might be a little different, but at Jayco, they want you to be able to bring everybody. So you have seat belts in every seating position. And again, this is a trifold flex steel couch and it actually is very comfortable if you want to lay and sleep just as it is but then they actually give you an additional air mattress that comes with the trifold couch so it blows up in about 60 seconds very very comfortable and you can deflate it it's power to do def deflate in 60 seconds as well so that's awesome look how easy it is just to put this the bed away if you have guests over it's away in two minutes and awesome Swing over to the dinette area in the all new Jayco Precept. This is an awesome floor plan. Again, we're in the 31 UL floor plan. We have this unit on special. The cool thing here is the dinette is on the campsite side and it has this awesome window here. So if the kids are playing outside and people are barbecuing, you can actually see what's going on because you have this big picture window right here. And then nighttime comes and you want to put a nice movie on or something. This is tricked out. This is phenomenal. This actually has a 50 inch televator in it. I, I don't have this in my house. I don't know how they can do it at that special sale price. So you actually have to have a 50 inch power televator lift system comes with it at that sale price. This is absolutely amazing folks. And the cool thing about this floor plan, once this is up, just think about it. You have the TV right here at your dinette. So you have a perfect view of the TV. No one has to break their neck. And then also you right across from the couch, you can watch your TV. A lot of brands have the TV situated in some awkward position, not the Jayco. They're thinking about how the utility of the unit's going to work out for you and your family. Up top, you also have solid hardwood doors and you have additional storage. It also comes with a Sony Blu-ray DVD player as well. So that comes with it. You don't have to pay extra for that. Extra outlets everywhere. If we come over to the cockpit area, you do have a ton of additional storage 
in the front here, you actually have a bank of about five additional cabinets. And again, you have that 120 inch windshield. So look how massive this is. We're at the Hillsborough County River State Park right now. And you can just see outside, you can see everything around you. It's amazing. They did a great job of this dash layout with the wood grain dash insert. Then also they actually gave you this table standard and the pedestal so you can you know, have it for additional eating area, play cards, what have you. You also get a GPS navigation with your Soundstream stereo system, XM Sirius Ready, Bluetooth, Bluetooth capability, and then AM FM radio as well. This also comes with a six-way power drivers and passenger seat. So it comes standard. It's not an option. It actually comes standard. So whether you're five foot five or six foot six, you're going to be very, very comfortable. It actually comes with the flex steel enhanced drivers and passenger seat and they're leather. They're not fabric, so they're easy to clean. You have double stitching down the side here and also flex steel carries that lifetime warranty on the frame itself. So they're going to last forever. Coming on over to the driver's seat here. Again, it's super easy transition from whichever angle you're getting in because that low profile doghouse. To the left over here, you actually have hydraulic leveling jacks. They're automatic leveling jacks. So one touch power, you have hydraulic jacks down and hydraulic jacks back up. Swing on over to the back of the coach. Again, this unit has two rooftop ACs. It's all ducted. It has a 15,000 B2 AC in the front and then a 13.5 in the far, far back. Over here is your control panel. So it comes with the auto gen start. You have your generator start and stop button right here, your digital readout, and all your slide controls. This also has heated holding tanks. You have gas and electric hot water heater. You also have a 1,000 watt inverter on this unit. And then on a 24,000 pound chassis, you're actually gonna get a 2,000 watt inverter. Coming on over to the bedroom, this is really, really unique. You actually have a king bed in the Jayco Precept 31 UL. I don't know how they did it, but they, they, they I can't believe, they, they did it. The bottom line is they did it. They put a king bed in the Jayco Precept. Most 31 foot class A motorhomes, you're only gonna get a small, maybe full or queen bed. Jayco, they upgrade that to the king, king bed. Again, you have a massive window in the back here with your blackout shade as well. Tons of storage across from the bed. Actually comes with the back bedroom TV standard at that special sale price. This actually lifts up for more storage, which is really, really trick. Super cool. You can put all your extra goodies back here. You know, you also have a Sony DVD Blu-ray disc player in the back. And then just look at all the storage here. I mean, you have, you know, at least 10 massive storage drawers, ball, ba ball bearing drawer glides, solid wood, full frame extension, rated for 75 pounds. Big closet on both sides. And then another one in the far back here. So you can hang all your clothes. As we swing over to the bathroom in the all new Jayco Precept, it actually has a pocket door. So it's actually a solid door instead of like one of those cheap curtains or bifold doors, some of those other brands put on their coaches. So it costs a little extra money to, to get the unit with the, the pocket doors, but as far as privacy goes, it's more residential. It's just a nicer feel to have something solid in front of you. Then going into the bathroom area, you actually have a, a huge window in here, so it's very nice, open and airy feeling. And again, you have the roller shade, so you have a day, and then you have a, a blackout nightshade for complete privacy. Down below, this is an area where they're not cutting corners. This is a testimonial to Jayco's heritage. They actually put solid surface counters in the bathroom with this solid uh, stainless undermount sink instead of like the cheap laminate some of these other brands will put on. Jayco's not going to do that to you. So it doesn't matter if you get a lot of water out here. It's not going to delaminate. This is all solid surface. And then you have tons of storage underneath. They did a great job with the nickel plated hardware, full frame extension drawers here, extra outlets, and a solid wood double wooden medicine cabinet. 
with two shelves up top. So you get tons of storage there. And then swing over to the shower area. The shower is an extra large shower. You have a, a big skylight up top. That's gonna give you about another four or five inches of headroom. You have a one piece shower surround, stop any water leaks. And then you have additional storage in the corner there. And then the other nice thing too, they actually put a glass shower door, a tri-fold glass shower door, as opposed to the cheap curtains some of these other brands are gonna try and use on you. So that's awesome, lots of space in the bathroom. Thanks for checking out the all new Jayco Precept. Just to recap a few items, keep in mind you're gonna get the famous two year warranty, the upgraded J-Ride handling package, the pebble grain fiberglass roof, the upgraded 22,000 pound chassis, the largest windshield in the industry at 120 inches wide. If you have any other questions, feel free to give us a call or check us out online at rv1.com. Thank you.